it's Ashley with Pugs and Pearls and today we are going to be reviewing the Ulta Fall Nail Pail. And this is the second time that I have reviewed a nail pail by Ulta. Um, I will link the one that I did from their summer collection. And these are always limited edition. They're $14 for the nail pail and you get eight different mini polishes as well as a little um, finger nail file in, in the box as well. So first off, let's talk about packaging. I love anything that is creative and thought out and I think that a nail pail, just like a real paint can, the top pops off just like you would a um, legitimate paint can that you're using for paint. I think that is so cute. Um, I wish there would be a subscription box called the nail pail because I would buy it and come on. I mean, you get an assortment of colors that are appropriate for the fall time. And I'm going to review each individual polish and let you know what I think. So some other thoughts about just the general types of nail polish these are. The dry to a glossy finish, they are, are seven creams and one that has a slight shimmer formula to it. They are very, very consistent. So um, they are all two coat polishes and they really even out on your nail. So even if you have a little bit too much, it kind of evens out really nicely um, to a very smooth and glossy finish. So I really do like the formula. I think that it's really nice, especially for these little minis. And let's go ahead and talk about the individual polishes. So the first one is called Below Zero, and it's basically just an off-white cream. I'm actually wearing it today. I really, really, really like this. I feel like it's a good base color if you're doing nail art. Um, that is the swatch there, and again, it is on my nails, but I think this is just a beautiful color, um, and it's not too bright. It's that perfect off-white. Next is called Royal Tea, and it is basically just a soft brown cream. Um, it comes off to me a little bit darker on the swatch, so you can kind of see right here, that's the soft brown cream. And again, all of these are two coats, super shiny. This is not with, it doesn't have a top coat, it's just extremely shiny, nice polish. This next one is called Sunny Side Up, and it is just a really nice kind of pumpkin cream orange. I'm really glad that they included some type of orange. Um, again, this is a two coater, and I think it's just a really pretty bright and creamy color for fall. The next one up is called Sky High and it is a dusty blue kind of teal um, cream and it is two coaters as well. And I really like this. It's such a, a pretty fall appropriate blue. Um, not too in your face but really I think for the season a gorgeous color. Next up is Party Teal Tomorrow, and this is one of my favorites from this collection. This is just a gorgeous blue-green teal. This one is a cream, and I hope you can see it. It is just a beautiful, it's a little bit dark on the coming off on the camera, but it's actually way brighter in person. Um, it's just a gorgeous deep teal for, again, the fall time. I really, really like that color. Again, this next one is a perfect like deep violet. It is called Lux Life, and it is a perfect cream purple for fall time. The swatch of this came off so pretty. Again, just a deep, vampy fall violet color. This next one is called Fleur Ever Yours, and it is just a cream dusty purple which I don't have many dusty purples, so I kind of really, really like this polish for this time of year as well. Again, really great formulas, very nice shiny finishes. And then last but not least is called Pink Paws, and this one is the one that has a slight shimmer in it. I don't know if you can even see it on camera. It is like really, really subtle. It's very hard to see, but it's a dusty mauve pink. And here it is up close. Again, hard to see that shimmer on it. It's, it's very, very subtle. It was the only one that had any shimmer from the entire collection. But again, I just think this packaging is so adorable. I love the idea of the nail pail. I think that it's worth the $14, especially if you want to try a bunch of different little polishes for fall season. Um, and again, I will link the one I did from their summer collection down below if you want to check that one out. Thanks guys so much for watching. Let me know if you're going to be picking up any of these polishes, and I'll talk to you in the comments below. Bye!